Hello, sports fans. This is Stephen here with Sports Trace Plus. I'm bringing you a very special breakdown. I'm going to be covering the Jacksonville Jaguars taking on the Chicago Bears. Before I get right into that, I want to make sure you're subscribed to the YouTube channel so you can get all the updates, all the breakdowns. Without further ado, let's get right into it. This is a matchup of two former number one overall picks. You're looking at Trevor Lawrence uh, out of Clemson, and you're looking at um, Caleb Williams out of USC. You're looking at both these guys and where their careers are right now. Trevor Lawrence has been struggling, but that game against the Colts helped them out a little bit to get them out of the hot seat as far as firing their coach. Caleb Williams and company, Caleb had his best game as a NFL player against the Carolina Panthers. You look at just how he stood in the pocket, stood tall, made the passes down the field. It helped that he did have Keenan Allen back. And you're looking at the uh, the offense start to umbrella itself to where you're seeing some of the different schemes actually work out. You're seeing some of the different uh, uh, moves and you're seeing some of the different shifts that's happening that's making a difference in this offense. Caleb Williams is passing the ball probably one of the best passers in the NFL right now. And the way that he's able to sit back there in the pocket with that offensive line when it actually does block, he has time to go down the field. Now, I will say this. This Jacksonville Jaguars defense is aggressive. They do have former number one overall picks on their team. They have Josh Allen, the other Josh Allen, not the quarterback, but the linebacker that can get to him. You got to think, he's not going to have a lot of time to just sit back there in the pocket. That offensive line of his is going to get torn apart because I feel like the defense of the Jaguars is going to be aggressive in this one. They're not sitting and waiting around, waiting for someone to save them. They're going to go attack and try to save their season now. I think the Jaguars defense is going to be the difference in this one. I think the, the Trevor Lawrence-led Jaguars have the advantage in this one. And the reason I say that, they're playing like a team that is up against the wall. They're playing like a team that knows that their coach could be fired at any time and they don't want to see Dougie P fired. So I think that overall, while Chicago may have the better wide receiver core, I think the better team falls down with the Jaguars. I know the Chicago Bears has a pretty good defense. I know they have key figures that do this and that. But you got to think, though, from the standpoint, when a team is playing with an aggressiveness, aggressiveness and a sense of urgency, that hits a little bit different. When you're eager to get after the quarterback, when you're hungry, you heard them interview after the game, they don't want to get Dougie P fired. They are playing like they want to win for their quarterback and want to win for their head coach. And accountability is what I heard in the interviews. I heard them being accountable for the next man, them being accountable for themselves and holding each other accountable when they're not hitting the gaps or they're not holding the assignment and they're taking it out on each other in practice. I think this team is turning it around right now. And I think Trevor Lawrence is going to have a better day than Caleb Williams. I'm picking the Jaguars to beat the Bears in an upset, and I think it's going to be a great game. All you Bears fans, Jaguars fans, get in the comment section below, and we'll see you on the next episode.